the police received yet another glowing tribute and gesture of appreciation for their role in defending the country in the Lahat Datu conflict. Information, Communications and Culture Minister Datuk Sri Dr. Rais Yatim, who also handed over monetary contributions from the ministry, thanked them for their sacrifice in keeping the country safe. He said at a presentation ceremony to the families of policemen killed during the conflict at the Malaysian Police Training Academy. Rais handed 10,000 ringgit to each of the eight families and a one Malaysia laptop to each child in the family. Inspector General of Police Tan Sri Ismail Omar thanked the ministry for their contributions. Meanwhile, Federal Internal Security and Public Order Director Commissioner Datuk Sri Salih Mat Rasid says security forces have begun the process of returning evacuees to their villages during the initial Lahat Datu conflict. As far as uh, election is concerned, I think it's okay. It's okay. We are ready. PDRM uh, ever ready uh, to help the SPR in this uh, uh, the coming uh, election PRU 30. Uh, if you can see right now. Uh, to upward north outward, that is Kampung Labian, Kampung Tanjung Bilis. So that means they are going up northward. So we are we are cleaning uh, from uh, Tanjung Batu, uh, Tanjung Batu, uh, Tanjung Labian, and Sungai Bilis. So that area is clear already now. He says that the security forces are in the process of cleaning up the remaining militants who have moved further north.